Hello friends and welcome to Coin Mühendisi Global. The 12th video of our introduction to technical analysis series is the average true range indicator and how to use it. But before we start, I would like to say that you can have all the crypto information you need for free from our YouTube channel. So do not forget to subscribe and keep the notifications on for our upcoming videos. Just like the Bollinger Bands, the average true range or shortly ATR is a volatility indicator too. ATR shows the average price variation of assets within a given time. Traders can use this indicator to determine the best time for trading. The average true range also calculates the gaps in the movement of price. Now let's add our ATR indicator from the indicators folder by typing ATR on the search box and continue. The calculation of the ATR is 14 period based. The period can be intraday, daily, weekly or monthly. You can adjust the time and change the moving average for your preferences. For example, a new average true range is calculated every day on a daily chart and every 15 minutes on a 15 minutes chart. If the average true range is expanding, it implies increasing in volatility in the market. The average true range is non-directional, hence an expanding range can be an indication of either short sale or long buy. However, the high ATR values are generally not maintained for long and the low ATR values imply low price volatility. If the average true range value remain low for some time, it may indicate the possibility of a reversal or continuation move and an area of consolidation. The idea is to identify the entry and stop levels. ATR trading strategy for a stop loss can be defined when you set your stop loss order below or above the support and resistance levels. The distance of the stop loss from the ATR value is usually set by traders at 1, 2 or 3 times the ATR value. For example, if the current ATR ATR is about 100 pips and the previous was about 300 pips, then your stop loss and take profit zones will be different. After all, you cannot expect to see the same movements if the current movement volatility is different than the previous 14 periods. Let me show you. Let's check this candle and the last low point. Our ATR shows that our current candle is about 100 pips. You can see the pips at here and you will see that it is different for each candle. And our previous low was about 150 pips. Let's say I would like to enter a trade in here. Then my stop loss level will be the sum of my current candle and our previous low level, which is roughly about 215 pips. But is it a good idea to enter now? Not really. Sure, the price is making higher lows, but it is not making higher highs yet. The ATR stop adjusts the consolidation areas or sharp price movements, triggering the unusual movement of prices in both upward and downward directions. The ATR is a useful indicator indicator because it shows what happens with the price volatility of a given asset. However, be careful when defining your average true range trading strategy because the indicator should not be used as a standalone tool. You can combine ATR with price action analysis with other indicators that will provide alerts about the price direction or the momentum. And that is it for today. I hope you have enjoyed our content. If you did, please drop a like under the video. And if you would like to see more of our content, please click on the subscribe button. Thank you for watching and take care until next time.